Hey guys, Aceboy here, and welcome back to another Stick War 3 video. It's that time of the day again, where the devs add some broken shit, so I figured I'd talk about it. Um, up on the chopping block today, of course, is walls. As a wise man once said, we need to build a wall, and it needs to be built quickly. By the way, I do have this new Versus series that I have been uploading a few videos on. I'm sure you guys have seen it, or maybe you haven't. And that's why I'm letting you know. I do have a playlist, and you can check that out on the top right. So without further ado, let's get into it. Oh yeah, that subscribe thing, you should probably do it. Basically, what happens here is you get a very reasonable spell, which is a big-ass wall a bunch of HP, like basically 500, and it's like more than a Spearton, and it just costs 50 gold and 50 mana, and you can place it wherever you feel like it, with of course a max wall limit of two. So that's a little broken, and by a little broken, I mean the Stick War 3 scene turned into Fortnite for a couple of days with people just building walls at each other until eventually one side won. And it was disappointing and boring, and I haven't recorded a lot during that time period, and for good reason. So the big deal breaker here with this wall is, of course, it instantly has all its HP, and you don't have to put any effort or thought into placing it down. Much like any of the spells in the game, except this one is quite literally dirt cheap, and the most game-changing thing that's ever been added to the game. Um, so that was nerfed. Now it costs 400 gold and 100 mana, and on top of that, you also have to let it build for 10 seconds, and it is vulnerable at the start. So, like, the HP slowly builds up. So, they went from having probably the strongest thing in the game to probably one of the weakest things in the game. I don't know if that cost is even remotely worth it. Maybe in late game or something, but... In practical uses, I don't think it's going to be that great, I hope. I really don't want to see this anymore. So today we're going to talk about the broken-ass walls that they added to the game, and also why I hate it. And it's quite simply, I don't like that you can just place it anywhere like a spell. I mean, in general, I am against most global spells because they're honestly quite boring, and you don't have to do anything to actually get use out of them. You press like a button or two, and the game completely changes in your favor. I don't really like that kind of stuff, and this is especially true with the wall that just kind of blocks you. Obviously, with the nerfs, it's a lot less of a big deal. Like, you know, 50-50 was absolutely terrible, <laughs> and I can't even believe it made it in in the first place. Uh, the 400-100 is a lot, you know, you're going to see it a lot less often, but... At the end of the day, it's still just a random wall you could place down anywhere where you can see and completely screw over something. Now, I preferred the Stick Empires approach to things, and I will be the first to say that Stick Empires and Stick War 3 are not the same game. Don't even try to compare them, and don't even try to justify why one feature should like make it to the other. They're totally different things, and I get that. But in this case, I would much rather prefer if like they had a miner walk out and build the wall, like Stick Empire style, because I feel like that was a lot less BS, such as just a random wall showing up wherever on the map. That's kind of crazy. It's kind of weird. I preferred, you know, at least the miners would build it and it, you know, made like 1% of sense, but now this is just going to be treated as a powerful global spell, even if it's not that great. I would rather it be cheaper and have a caveat to it where your miner has to go walk to the location and build it. You have a miner if you're playing the video game, so this shouldn't be an issue with tying it to miners, and I think that would allow you to make it cheaper because you do have that extra thing where you can't just build it wherever you feel like it. You have to build it upon conquered land because it would be on your side of the battlefield because your miner is going somewhere and he would be dead if he was not where you're at so i would rather the wall turn into more of something like that because i honestly just kind of prefer that stuff uh, like i said i really don't like global spells and there's a ton of them that exist in the game already i'm not a big fan of most of them but it is beta and they'll probably change in some meaningful way so i'm not too worried about it but these walls really uh, rub me the wrong way. I don't know. 
That kind of stuff, I would rather be tied together in some meaningful way with something else other than, hey, now this wall exists in your base um, and you couldn't do anything about it. I mean, now you can just break the wall early, which I do like that change. I do like that you're able to destroy the wall before it gets built because when it just showed up with 500 HP, it was actually ridiculous. But I still don't really like that you can just place it wherever. It's really just a really oppressive spell that you can't do a whole lot about and it's pretty annoying. But yeah, that's just my thoughts on it. Um, let me know in the comments below if you agree or disagree. You know, I'm open to a conversation in the comment section about this kind of stuff. I just don't really like the direction these walls are going. And I hope that's not an indication of future stuff to come. Because I would really like to keep the global game changing stuff that you can do nothing about uh, to a minimum. But yeah, I'm all for bringing back the minor wall. I think it wouldn't be that big of a deal. It could be exactly how it works currently, except the miner would have to walk to that location before you could build the wall. Then you can also make it cheaper at that point and use it for probably its intended purpose, which is defending your miners, because now your miners don't have to walk very far to put that down and they're not in any meaningful danger. But also if you want to be a dick, you can go build the walls at the <laughs> enemy base or something, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, I feel like that's a good compromise on the thing. I just don't like that it's global. That's all it comes down to. All the other global spells so far kind of, you know, I gave them a pass because, you know, it's like acid rain falling over the whole map or this sudden snowstorm happening on this certain aspect of the map or this magical barrier that blocks arrows shows up. But, like, this is just straight up, here is a structure, and it's going to be in your way, and it's just happening before your eyes. <laughs> Subscribe, or both sides of your pillow will be warm tonight. I will make sure of it. And as always, thanks for watching.